should have. Yeah, see, Todd. Ding, ding, ding. Got it in one guess. This isn't a joke, Thea. He's what the... were you thinking? Look, he's poison. He's poison to everyone, but especially to you. He is in such pain, yeah. Antonio. He deserves to be in pain. I try not to care about him, but I just can't help myself. I care about the man. Look, whatever he's brought down on himself, if it's like every other time, you can bet he deserved it. You're right, of course. So what's sad? What's sad is that all he really wants is to be loved. Oh, God. Look, I know that sounds cheesy, but it's true. And he loves Blair. I know that he does. And she's left him. Oh, she's a piece of work, too. <laughs> Say that again. But you know what's kind of amazing? What? That you can't let the guy go? That, too. That Blair and Todd are actually better people when they're together. Yeah? Well, then, why don't you let Blair have Todd and you stay the hell away from him? You're right. I have to. So do it. I should go to the airport. You want a police escort? Oh, to make sure I get there safely or to make sure I actually go? Both. Don't worry, Donio. I can't help Todd. He's on a path to self-destruction now. No one can help him. You take my kids away from me. Watch me. If you want a war, I'll give you a war. There's more to the story. One life to live. ABC Daytime. I know what I've got to do to you. The difference? They can't. Visine Tears gets the dry out. Naturally. He broke her heart. Blair and I are husband and wife. I'm sure we'll find a way to work this out. Our marriage is over. You're not getting another chance. Now she wants revenge. And I'm not letting you take my kids away from me. Watch me. If you want a war, I'll give you a war. There's more to the story. One life to live. ABC Daytime. I know what I've got to do to you. You're back. You came back. You, you got my message. Yeah, I got it. And you came back. The star and I... had a long talk today. Uh... All right, w w what'd you talk about? She heard us fighting and she was very upset. Yeah, well, I was upset too. She wants us to get back together. Of course she does. That's why I'm here. I knew you'd give me a second chance. I'm not giving you a second chance. Okay, it's like a th third chance. Not a third. Fourth chance, whatever. Call it whatever you want. It doesn't matter. It does matter. You're right. It matters. It matters. I should have told you the truth about Jack. Yeah, you should have. I won't lie to you anymore. I swear, from now on, I will tell you the truth, the whole truth, and nothing but the truth. But really, it's just just to you, because I'm still going to lie to everybody else. Because, okay, I won't. I won't lie to you, because we, we, we've got each other, right? And, and you've also got Jack, and you've got Star. That's four, four Mannings. I'll make it up to you, Blair. I will. I'm going to make this up to you. From now on, I mean it. I'm going to be perfect. The perfect husband, the perfect father, stop, the perfect Todd, everything. Stop, Todd, stop. You're not going to make it up to me. You're not getting another chance. Our marriage is over. What are you talking about? 
This marriage isn't over. Yes, it is. No, it isn't. Yes, it is. No, you talked to Star. Star said that she wants us to stay together. That's what she wants, I don't. Well, it's two against one. You've been outvoted. It doesn't work that way, Todd. But you can't do this to me. You... And, and you, you can't do this to Star. I mean, come on. She always gets everything that she wants, especially if it's something important. What? That's why I want this to be a very clean and easy break. And you're going to do this to Star. She's going to be devastated. I know. And that's OK with you? What the hell kind of a parent are you? I just figured the sooner we get this divorce underway, the easier it'll be for Star to deal with it, and we'll get on with our lives, all of us. I don't want to deal with I don't want to move on or get on with my life or anything. I don't want a divorce. Well, I didn't want to think that my son was dead either. And I didn't want to believe that Jack was another woman's son. But we don't always get what we want now, do we, Todd? You know, I, I, I should have I should have told you the truth. The uh, I was gonna I was gonna tell you the truth. Once you found out that Jack was your son. But what about before? Whether he was Max's or yours, I was still his mother. Oh, yeah, no, I know that. And if you hadn't found out, Todd, what were you going to do? You going to let me spend the rest of my life thinking that my son was dead? Huh? I, 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 I don't know. I didn't, I, I didn't want to tell you the truth, because I thought if I told you the truth that you'd do something you stupid like what you're doing now. You didn't have any problem telling Gabrielle or Alex, did you, huh? I didn't tell them anything. They just kind of found out. Well, who else found out, Todd? I, I, you know what? It doesn't matter. It's over. And uh, I want you out of my life. I want you out of our lives. Our lives? Yeah. Mine, stars, and Jack's. <laughs> no, 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 no way. No, I'm not letting you take my kids away from me. Watch me. over what what court in the world is ever going to let you take jack and star away from their father what court in the world is ever going to force a mother to have their children visit a convent what's that supposed to mean what are you talking about a convict you broke the law todd you broke many many laws are, are you threatening me? I'm just stating a fact. You're going to call the cops? I don't have to. You told me they already know. Oh, my. I wonder if that is them now. You can answer that door? What? You're getting nervous, Todd? Coincidence. We were just talking about you. You set me up. Hello, Todd. We have a warrant for your arrest. Warrant for what? Oh, kidnapping. <laughs> Fraud. Reckless endangerment. You know what? It took us a while to come up with the charges, Todd. You see, no one in my office ever, ever dealt with anything this sick before. Let's just say I did a few of these things, and I'm not saying that I did. All this happened in Mexico, which, as far as I know, is way out of your jurisdiction. Well, so you say. But the kidnapping of Blair's baby... My baby. Jack is my baby, too. Though the kidnapping took place in Mexico, Jack is a citizen of Landview, as are you, Todd. You know what? Go ahead. Arrest me. Come on. My lawyer will have this thing thrown out before it goes to trial. You don't have a case. Actually, that's up to Blair. Do you want to press charges against Todd? 